James Hargreaves by Madison Stinsman. James was born in 1712. This is what England looked like at the time he was born. In the 1760s, two new machines, the spinning jenny and the water frame, caused a revolution in the textile industry because both machines markedly sped up the process of making thread for weaving. These machines were adapted to use the power of flowing water or hydraulic power. This means that the motion of the water would turn a wheel that was connected by a complicated system of pulleys and belts used to run the machines. Another machine called the spinning mule was developed later in the 1700s. When it was hooked up to water power, just one person could do the work of 3,000 hand spinners. The new textile machines were extremely efficient at producing the fine thread needed to make high quality cloth and they caused the cottage spinning industry to collapse soon after they were introduced. His invention was named after his daughter Jenny. The Royal Society of Arts offered a competition to anyone who could make a faster sewing machine. His was named the Spinning Jenny. This invention could spin eight threads at once verse one by hand. but he didn't want to make money off of his jenny. In his time this was the most efficient way to weave. I couldn't find a picture of his family, but this is good enough. With the invention of the flying shuttle, double the amount of thread was required. England had become yarn hungry, but spinning the thread on the spinning wheel was still a time-consuming and inefficient method. It was carried out by women in their homes as a source of income. Four to ten spinners made just enough yarn for one weaver. It didn't take long to find a solution. In 1764, James Hargreaves invented the first mechanical spinning machine, which he named after his daughter, Jenny. The spinning Jenny enabled the spinning of eight, then later over 100 threads at a time. However, it was still powered by hand. The people he lived around trashed his house in fear of the Jenny. So, he moved to Nottingham, England. He developed a partnership with Thomas James. People stole his idea and he never got justice for the invention being his own. This is James and his daughter, Jenny. He died on April 22, 1778, 